And now, here are all the secrets of our tackle and gear. Hello folks, we're going to talk to you a little bit about the gear that we've been using on today's episode. Uh, we start out with the new uh, Rapala Classic Trout Rods. Um, these are great, lots of action on them and uh, worked really well. We paired them up with uh, the new Shift Reels as well. And these are spinning reels, so something we're not really used to using on our show. It's usually fly reels and mooching reels, so to say. Uh, but these worked really well. And we put on the uh, Suffix uh, braid, the 832 Super line, which has the one weave of gore in it. Great for casting, also cuts through the water nicely. And this yeah. is a 10 pound that we used here, which is equivalent to about four pound mono. So it's really small in diameter and really worked well. And then Brian, you talked to Mike Ramsey up here and got some local knowledge on what to use. So this yeah, is the so tricks the, that he said. The terminal gear it's, uh, that Mike suggests certainly was, uh, we've got a little four-aught silver uh, Lurie Jensen Dodger. Yep. And then critical is a little uh, kokanee snubber yep. because they have such uh, soft mouths and uh, you gotta play them gently, especially in the summer months. Yep. And then to that, we had between two and a half and three feet of uh, leader, which is, uh, 10 pound suffix fluorocarbon. So uh, really strong, can't see it in the water. And then the two lures that were most effective for us were the these two lure Jensen uh, needlefish and uh, kokanee killer. Yeah, so and various we colors too. We tried various, different colors. Yep, different colors. And we did, uh, we did uh, put some of, um, yep. We tipped it up with some, uh, some, some Procure corn that Mike had made up yep. as well. He used up some of the, the kokanee or corn recipe that Procure has. But we also added for a little bit is the, the, shrill, uh, the shrimp and the krill, krill gel as well, just to give it an extra little bite. And, and, and it worked again today. I mean, this yeah. stuff is made by anglers for anglers and this stuff really works well. And if we'd forgotten about it, you could tell. Yeah. <laughs> we switched it up, yeah. Yeah, you know, absolutely. and we can't, we can't forget to mention the Kingfisher boat we fished off of again in luxury out, out in the water and a little overkill sometimes, but this boat, performed really well out there today. It was great to walk around. We had four people in the boat and we didn't bump into anybody. It was, no, it was absolutely good. very stable. And then of course, Scotty manual downriggers with the line counters were great for getting the precise depth. Yep. And then the Yamaha motors got us around where we needed to go. So that's it. So again, folks, these are all the items that we've used on our show. We'll flash up a quick list for you. You can take notes and uh, get yourself geared up here. All Tackle and Gear is available at Steveston Marine and Hardware. Stay connected with BC Outdoor Sport Fishing on the web, on Facebook, and on Twitter.